overseas. The numbers from Italy tonight only worsening. In fact, this was the number today. 627 people dying in just the past 24 hours. The worst yet. So tonight here, we're going to take you inside the hospital at the epicenter of their outbreak. We warn you it's difficult, but it's also a warning for what doctors on the front lines could soon face here. Maggie Ruley from London tonight. Tonight, a glimpse inside a nightmare. <laughs> a race to save lives in the Italian hospital at the epicenter of the deadliest coronavirus outbreak in the world. And this is just the emergency ward, not the intensive care unit. The ICU is already overwhelmed. Those plastic bubble helmets are connected to ventilators to help the gasping patients breathe. This hospital is one of the most advanced in Europe, but the victims are everywhere, on gurneys, in waiting rooms, in hallways. It's a very severe pneumonia. Every day, 50 to 60 patients who come to our emergency department with pneumonia. They say they want the rest of the world to know that this is what's waiting for them if nations don't lock down. I never feel so stressed in my life. We are doing our best, but maybe it's not. Is not enough. Thousands of volunteer student doctors in Italy are being rushed to the region. And an American relief group has airlifted a field hospital. But there are fears it will not be nearly enough. And Italy's nightmare is now being shared by Spain. Deaths there soaring by 30% overnight, 199 fatalities in 24 hours, over 1,000 total deaths. Reports out of Italy tonight show that more than 70% of the deaths there are in men. But David experts say they're still mystified as to why this virus seems to be hitting men harder than women. David. We're going to drill down on that, men versus women, with Dr. Jen in just a moment. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.